Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Surviving Mars. Uh, this is my 1075% difficulty playthrough. And uh, yeah, uh, we're, we're gearing up as you can see, We've got a dome here, gearing up to bring, uh, bring colonists in. But before we do, we need to get some, uh, uh, well, we need to, uh, we need to get some, some machine parts in, um, and, uh, yeah, uh, we might be able to actually, uh, build, uh, machine parts, um, because they need, uh, metals, and we have that, so, I, I maybe I should do that, but, um, uh, Right, anyway, um, let's uh, get the clock running. Uh, we're in the middle of a cold wave here, and uh, I'm definitely going to wait till the cold wave is done to bring uh, um, colonists in. And we definitely need to have the ranch completed before then as well. Now, the ranch will uh, produce meat, right? And that will piss off the vegans. But it should produce enough food reliably that we don't have uh, significant issues now oh we've got a meteor storm in two sols we've got a meteor storm ongoing over here right um yeah these guys are frozen aren't they yeah so we're gonna have to roll the dice now that should be fun. Um, yeah, because I haven't researched subsurface heating yet. Uh, and that's something that I probably should do, is uh, get subsurface heating. Uh, but the, uh, the important uh, thing here is uh, uh, we need to get the, uh, the ramps built uh, so we can collect these uh, anomalies. Uh, this one, yeah, and, and they're just about done. So we're going to have the ramps this time around. And uh, that will definitely uh, allow us to make some actual progress on things. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, all told, um, yeah, I'm going to have to wait out the uh, meteor storm. Uh, and the cold wave. The cold wave especially for souls. Um, and you... Um, get constructed. Need to actually build it. Um, right. Okay. So, so that will uh, uh, progress at some point. Uh, well, let's just uh, up the tempo here and uh, let things happen just a trifle faster. You know. Uh, and meanwhile, let's um, check in on here. Um, deep scanning. Have we revealed deep scanning yet? Um, it's in physics. No, we haven't. Okay, so the next, um, well, compact passenger uh, module, that's what we're actually waiting for to bring anything in. But, yeah, uh, what we need is some cash, which we don't have. Um, oh, the metal supply is not overflowed yet. We found a anomaly, which is a research anomaly, and our, uh, buddy, um, our buddy is headed off. Is he? Nope. We'll... Uh, send our explorer off. Um, now. Ah, that's done. Okay. You can come up here. And over here. You aren't done yet. Okay. Now, let's go over here. Where's our... Yeah, there's our buddy. Yep, that's our buddy. Uh, where are you going first? 
we're going down. Yay, we're going down. Uh, so that's fun. Now, um, oh, we're collecting um, polymers down there, aren't we? Um, and we're going to reveal techs. Yeah, it looks like we're going to reveal techs. What are we collecting down there? That's metals, I think. Yeah, that's metals. Okay, so uh, it'll be useful to see what the uh, what gets revealed in the tech tree. Um, right. Okay, new techs. Plasma cutters, waste rock liquefaction, open research. Okay, well, that's, uh, that's okay. It's expensive, but it's useful. I was hoping for something in the physics tree. But, you know, so be it. Um, now, where are we going? Ah, the uh, research anomaly. So that uh, should get us some distance toward uh, um, the... toward the um, research. That's what that, that, that that's what it does. The research anomaly gives us something toward the research. Yes. Uh, yeah, yeah, uh, from the Department of Obvious Department. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Right, okay. Uh, we gained 1,500. And we found another anomaly. Uh, so we've got a couple research anomalies over there. Um, yeah. Uh, the meteor storm ends in six hours. Oh, there's our buddy. Um, okay. We got another anomaly. Um, hopefully we can avoid getting clobbered by it. There we go. Look at all the litter there from the uh, meteors, eh? Um, right. Okay, so we're uh, doing a research anomaly. Uh, we got 17 hours for the uh, next uh, meteor storm. Uh, the real question is, where's it going to hit? Because uh, if it hits over here, we're hosed. Uh, because we don't have the resources to build um, meteor defenses. So... Yeah. We got a thousand. Okay. Well, we're up to 93% on our uh, research. Now we're over here on another one. Uh, so that we should finish compact passenger module. Uh, that will be good. Right. Research complete. Uh, let's take a look here. Extractor amplification factory AI. Um, electronics factory. Uh, polymers. It's... Uh, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to need to get that one. Uh, yeah, kind of obvious, isn't it? Um, subsurface heating, yeah, we'll, we'll do that. Um, I 
Oh, yeah. Uh, we want this one, too. Uh, get terraforming subsidies. Yeah, that that's what I need to do. Uh, good. Right. Uh, okay, now up here, our uh, metal stacks are basically full. So I'm going to uh, depot. Uh, metals depot. Put a couple more of those up there. Um, we got 1500. Uh, so we're up on subsurface heating. Now, where is. No. Um, where is our uh, dude? Oh, he's up here. He's exploring. Okay, where are they? Bugger. Yeah, see, I figured that was going to happen. Yeah. Uh, I let my uh, meteor defenses freeze, and uh, this is what I get. Um, where? Yeah. Yeah, this is going to be really bad. Um, anyway, not much I can do about that, so I'm going to go over... Where's my... Um, where's my explorer guy? Right, okay. You... Um, I think maybe should, well, come up here, um, right, okay, we got subsurface heating. Um, well, let's, um, uh, build a heater, um, here, or here, here. And uh, I'll build another one up here. Yep. Okay. And then these guys. Uh, right. Okay. Now let's see how fast those can be built. Um, I'm also going to need pipes. What got hit? Um, okay, I got to take a look at this stuff. Right. Uh, right. Building is destroyed. One, two. Power accumulator. Rebuild. Um... Rebuild. Um, we'll leave that one. Uh, rebuild the power accumulators, though. Um, sensor tower, sensor tower, sensor tower. Wind turbine. Power accumulator. Yeah, okay. Because we can live without the, uh, whoops, the, uh, 
the uh, okay that 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 uh, where are we oh uh, we got low resources yeah we got we got a destroyed rover huh well I guess we need to do that uh, drone salvage drone salvage drone salvage drone salvage and uh, okay well there isn't much more we can do here yeah okay well what I'm gonna do is uh, wow I'm going to build the drone hub here uh, so that we get a couple more drones at least yeah Oh dear. Yep. See, this is what happens when you don't uh, plan things properly. But if this had happened after I brought my colonists, the colony would be done. So. Um. Yeah. So I'm definitely going to need the uh, terraforming subsidies to get some stuff. Well, the cold wave is over, at least. Uh, we got a whole saw left in the meteor storm, though. Uh, these things usually drift. Um, it looks like it might be drifting off finally. Uh, that would be good. Um, yeah, that would definitely be good. Uh, over here. You are done. Okay. You can come back up here. Um, right. Okay. What do subsurface heaters need? Ah. Well, let's uh, not do that then. Right. So that gets us uh, a machine part. Okay, so we got that guy repaired. Um, okay, buildings destroyed. Wind turbine. No. Water extractor. Yes. Buildings destroyed. Sensor tower. Sterling generator. We don't have the resources to rebuild that. Concrete extractor. Well, we can let that wait. Yeah, okay. The destroyed buildings can wait until we get enough... Uh, uh, cash to bring some uh, resources in. So we need to bring in uh, machine parts and some electronics. Uh, okay. Well, we'll be able to do that once the uh, once the research finishes. Uh, and we're generating power with the uh, power accumulators and uh, uh, solar panels. So, we don't need to worry about uh, machine parts for power generation. Um, which means I can actually... Well, I might as well just let that run. Um, yeah. Okay. So, we got a lot of debris around here, but... Uh, 
Right. Well, what? That's destroyed. Rebuild. Remove the remains. Yeah. Uh, this one will remove the remains of the wind turbine and will remove the remains of the wind turbine. Yep. Okay, so far so good. Now. Now this. Uh, right, okay. Goose, chicken produces five in one soul, 15 in two souls. Turkey is 60 in five souls, so that's 12 per soul. That, I need two of those. Uh, okay. Uh, build. Um... Uh, here and we need a uh, ranch stick one of those in there what does this need to build <laughs> one machine part um, okay and then uh, yeah it should be uh, what if I put three ranches? Uh, yeah, so that's going to need a couple of machine parts. What if we destroy that building? And uh, large wind turbine. That will get us another one. Um, yeah. Okay, that gets us, uh... Okay, now we've got, uh, electrostatic, uh, dust storm coming. Uh, why do we have insufficient water there. Uh, water production. Stored water. Okay. Water production demand. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, good. We're at 27% on terraforming subsidies, so that should be able to get things straightened out ultimately. Uh, let's go and look in here. Uh, we'll get a research boost when the last um, last one of these finishes. Um, um, where are these uh, meteors coming from? Uh, anyway. Uh, good. Uh, well, uh, yeah, that was a little bit more uh, problematic than I rather um, wanted there. Uh, right. Well, we are making progress. So as, as long as I can get some machine parts in, uh, we're, uh, we're good. Uh, and then uh, I'll need to uh, build the uh, machine parts thing, and uh, yeah. Okay, so mission profile. Uh, where are we at? What research? Yeah, we need. We get some money for that. We've got the second rocket. Okay, those are fine. Um, where are we here? Command center. Nope. Um, milestones. 
Um, first human, no, 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 no. Scan all sectors, 2,500 research. That should make uh, a substantial dent. Um, uh, yeah, that, that should be, that should make a dent. Um, can I build, I don't have vapor, moisture vaporation, right. Uh, okay, well, where, where are we at here? Uh, we're at 32%. Uh, we've got one, two, okay, we've got uh, six more sectors to finish scanning. Uh, you can come up here. Um, yeah, okay, so Yeah, we don't have a huge drain on electronics. Uh, right. Okay, so we've got access to the whole area here. So... Electrostatic dust storms. I really don't like electrostatic dust storms. Uh, oh, four souls. Wow, that's nasty. Right, anyway. Um, much excitement there. Um, these guys can be powered down. Um, yeah. Yeah, of course there's no life support in there. Um, that's because we can't actually, you know run anything with no power um but i'm not worried about that at the moment because we don't have any colonists yeah i know um astounding isn't it uh and that's uh, kind of why i've been uh, a fairly deliberate uh, deliberately slow in my uh um operations here uh, but once I have the machine parts problem sorted out uh, with the terraforming subsidies, because I, whoops, I believe I have, uh, I have three supply pods. So yeah, uh, there's that. Now, uh, so what, what am I going to bring in? Um, well, I'm going to bring in as many machine parts as I can, and uh, electronics as well. Uh, so, uh, yeah, that will uh, that will get as much as I possibly can um, uh, straightened out, right? Uh, okay. And we got three souls remaining on the uh, dust storm. Uh, electrostatic dust storms aren't quite as intense as great dust storms, but they are dust storms nevertheless. Um, I want to actually go in here. Um, deep scanning is uh, revealed. Uh, we definitely want that queued up. Uh, right, okay. Um, okay. Yeah, we're, uh, I probably want to, uh, research drone hubs as well. Um, yeah, we definitely 3D machining first. Uh, right. As we have plenty of, if we can get a uh, sufficient supply of, uh, electronics components and machine parts uh, being produced, then uh, we can uh, solve a few of the uh, issues that we're going to have uh, shortly. 
Um, yeah. However, we've got plenty of uh, metals and we've got polymers uh, in uh, fairly heavy uh, quantity. Uh, so, yeah, we're, we're collecting the resources from those meteor storms and generally all around uh, making some sort of progress on things. Uh, yeah, we'll get terraforming subsidies in a reasonable length of time. Uh, you know, it's Sol 105, right? So, you know, uh, based on the time scale of the game, uh, Sol 105 would be basically a century into the, uh, uh, a century into uh, running the uh, game or running the colony uh, set up. So uh, given how difficult things ha are at the 1075 difficulty and that we need to be careful when we bring our colonists in, uh, I figured uh, it would be uh, reasonably smart to, uh, you know, make sure that things are pretty solid before we bring them in and lose them all, right? Because we're going to be bringing in 44 colonists. Uh, because if we go in here and we look in Passenger Rocket, well, 42 colonists. So, uh, you know, we can bring in 42 and... Uh, and that will uh, that will will bring in uh, that that'll get things to a pretty good uh, spot. To uh, I'm not going to call them just yet. Uh, what I am going to do, I think, right? Yeah. What I'm going to do while I'm waiting for things to happen is I'm going to go in here under decorations, and I'm going to chuck in a couple of statues. You know, just for giggles, is those only take uh, uh, those only take concrete, so uh, we have that. So you know, we can definitely build that. Right. So I'll check those in. That will increase the comfort of the building of the uh, dome. And uh, like the key is, we need to uh, we need to keep the uh, residents comfortable, so that they start having babies. Right. Uh, otherwise, our colony's doomed. Doomed, I tell you. Probably is anyway, but uh, after that meteor storm, that was uh, rather um, exciting. Uh, we've got uh, five more sectors to scan for the bonus on that. Uh, I think that will probably put us over the top if that... Well, that will put us over the top if we haven't got there naturally by then. Right. Uh, yeah, there really aren't a lot of non-deep anomalies on the map, uh, on, you know. So, um, ooh, we found anomalies. We've got an event anomaly. Uh, well, let's... Uh, Let's uh, follow our guy down there. He's going to go for the event one first. Uh, right. Ooh. No, that's fine. Um, yeah, we're going for the event one first, and then this... No, we're going for the technology unlock first. Okay. Well, we'll see what techs get unlocked. Uh, yeah, uh, that might unlock something cool. Maybe it'll do an all five uh, or all trees unlock, and then we'll get to reveal the, the uh, wonder at the top of that one tree there. I can't remember which one that is. Okay, I'm going to... I'm going to let it scan both of these anomalies, and then, uh, then I think that's where I'll put the cut. And then, uh, you know, just uh, for anyone uh, wondering, uh, the next um, ah, 
open research screen. Oh, it's the space elevator. Right. Okay, so this was an all uh, fusion reactors. Uh, Eternal fusion would be nice to go with those. Uh, rover printing. Um, gene adaptation. Okay. Yeah, nothing horribly exciting here. Close. Uh, okay, we're... Uh, now this could could be good or it could be bad. They're mostly good though. Uh, the dome needs repair, um, right? Um, yeah, we'll see what that comes out at. I'll also send the uh, send our buddy home. Uh, when it finishes. Uh, okay. Whoops. Uh, anomaly. Uh, 50 new applicants. Well, this was the time to get it. Um, so that means that uh, we uh, we have more applicants to choose from when uh, when when we select our uh, colonists. That means we can get probably bring fewer with uh, unfortunate flaws. Uh, right. Uh, now the dome. Uh, oh, we don't have any power for the. Um, Uh, what if we bring this uh, over here? Yeah, there weren't enough drones in range. Yeah, because I don't have any uh, non-solar uh, power uh, going and the batteries are empty. Um, we don't... Uh, we don't have enough... Uh, power right and that's fine uh i will uh, do something about that when i have some machine parts i'll put up a couple of uh, uh um wind things turbines that's what they're called uh, okay so four hours left in the dust storm and then the power will start back up and then we should be okay uh anyway uh right i said i was going to put the cut in after that um that um, uh, research thing so uh, that's what I'm going to do uh, so I guess uh, pause so the next episode is going to be out on Thursday instead of next Tuesday uh, because I'm taking a short break from transport fever 2 uh, so this is a one-off I'm just using uh, another episode of surviving Mars to fill the gap uh, uh, because this is going to be a long series and uh, at least quite a bit quite a bit left to it yet so uh, next uh, next episode will be out in two days and then uh, after that uh, the episode after will be out on the usual time on Tuesday next week and then it should be back to every Tuesday uh, anyway uh, that's uh, that's going to be all for this episode, so stay healthy. Don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. And, uh, yeah, see you next time.